unrepentant Nazi war criminal Eric Priebke has been buried in an unmarked grave within the grounds of an unidentified long-abandoned prison in Rome, according to Italian media reports. The news may well mean closure to arguments over his final resting place, weeks after both the city of Rome and the Catholic Church refused permission for a public funeral in Rome for the Holocaust denier. Priebke, who died at the age of 100 last month, participated in the slaughter of 335 people, including 75 Jews, just outside Rome in 1944. It was one of the worst massacres in German-occupied Italy during World War II. Prior to his death, the defiant perpetrator had been serving a life sentence under house arrest. Anger spilt out among Italy's Jewish community after Priebke said in a final statement issued by his lawyer that Jews were not gassed in Nazi death chambers. The ultra-conservative Catholic group Society of St. Pius X, a sect that broke away from the Vatican in 1970, offered to hold the funeral. The service was eventually cancelled after protests. Furious Italians, who had to be restrained by riot police, shouted abuse and kicked the hearse carrying the war criminal. It is not the first time the sect has been the target of criticism. One of the group's previous bishops was Richard Williamson, who was suspended from the church and convicted of incitement in a German court after he denied the Holocaust publicly. Priebke's native Germany also refused the body, saying his burial site could become a place of pilgrimage for neo-Nazis. International Jewish Human Rights Organization, the Simon Wiesenthal Center, campaigns for Nazi war criminals to be brought to justice whatever their age. In July, Operation Last Chance was launched in Germany, offering substantial rewards for any information leading to surviving suspects of World War II hate crimes. As the news spreads, memorials in Rome's Jewish quarter serve as a reminder for those who died during the Nazi occupation.